All right, so we got the most hilarious fake Minecraft speed runs. Let's get right to the video. Uh, oh yeah, my God! Is that full netherite gear and portal frames and so much more? So oh much my God, more. guys! It's been my on mobile. seat is extremely OP, guys. There's a lot of people out there that cheat in their Minecraft speed runs, and it's pretty funny to watch. So here are the most hilarious All fake right, Minecraft speed runs. This first so speed like run starts fake. by literally spawning in the middle of a village. The first sign that this run is fake, as he clearly cut his recording, located a village, and then just pretended to have spawned there. The chance of this happening legitimately is just abysmally low. The chest. Is in the blacksmith he spawns right next to has an insane amount of obsidian which definitely seems pretty suspicious he as the words of the great cast nasty would say sorry unk cast nasty tried to finesse a finesser that's crazy something i would do i i can't lie. Something I would do. Finds even more obsidian in a second blacksmith and is ready to enter the nether. But there's one thing he's still missing. A flint. He digs into a hill, presumably to find one, and he actually does. But not in the way you might expect. Roll the clip. That's right, this guy placed a flint underground via an item frame. Something that he may have gotten away with if it wasn't for the absurd amount of lag he experiences throughout the whole run. That caused the item frame to break right in front Man, of our really own eyes. He finesse. enters the nether and starts walking in a very specific direction. He must be looking for a fortress. Wait, what? why is he building a portal? Well, that all happened quite quickly. He's now suddenly in the end, might I add, in creative mode, and is ready to fight the dragon and end his run. Ah, uh, well, he had us in the first half. Mm, actually, not really. I'll Bro grade this brother. guy's clearly fake speedrun with an F, which stands for fat-headedness. This oh next my runner starts by heading straight to a desert temple. But watch okay. what happens and see if you spot what's wrong. Ain't that a booby trap, right? Oh, he's on... The runner cut his video as he was building up and out of the temple, and then resumed. Ooh, caught him! Ooh, that's something I would do. I'll be, I'll really be honest, bro. If I was, re oh, try to finesse a finesser. Man, Unc was right, bro. There's too many finessers out here, bro. That's crazy. The runner cut his video as he was building up and Boom, out of the temple cut. and then oh resumed it while still building up, but in a different temple. This becomes very clear once you notice that the area surrounding him once he exits the temple is completely different than the area surrounding him when he entered. He then heads right to a nearby village, evidently the reason that he did this trick with the temple. The runner does the same thing again while in the nether by digging slightly into a wall near the fortress he had just looted and then turning around to suddenly be in a completely different location next to his portal so that he can return to the overworld you would have caught on to this dude's cheating even if you were only barely paying attention so i'll give him a d for dang dude you really suck this oh next God. run was definitely unexpected to say the least it okay. starts off pretty normal with this guy looting a village near his spawn which okay. actually seems legitimate unlike literally every other fake speedrun but things start to get crazy when he enters a desert temple and finds guns This is what we doing now. This is what we doing now. This is what we doing now. Is this literally what we doing now? Okay, okay, that that's a little much for me. This guy just gets an A that doesn't stand for anything. I'm just honestly afraid to mess with him. This next yeah, runner do definitely that, doesn't seem like he understands the rules of speedrunning. He starts in a village where he shows off his excellent level of agility. After wiping out an entire population of animals, he makes a very interesting decision. He announces that he's going to the bathroom and shuts the video off, and then turns it back on and he's suddenly in the stronghold. What a very skilled and talented speedrunner. E. This next speedrunner starts by getting some wood and heading straight to a oh, village, but man. things start to get sketchy when he opens a chest, where he okay. finds items that normally only spawn in blacksmith chests, like an iron chest plate and ingots. Also 
you'll notice that when he takes the items from the chest, he doesn't get an achievement from them, showing that he has uh, obtained yeah, them before, yeah, which tells it, yeah. us that he placed these items here prior to the run. Next, this guy heads to a house right outside of the main village, something that most runners probably wouldn't do, as going to this house would waste a lot of time, considering these types of houses don't spawn with chests. But there's actually a chest in this one, obviously one placed put, by him, yeah, and it's it filled there, yeah. with, no, just, just no. In the village's temple building is a brewing stand, just like normal, but in the brewing stand is two healing potions, which Come on, dude. Man, Next, really? he heads to a second hey, village. This it, one in a desert. But he clearly knew where it was beforehand because there's no way he could have seen it, considering how it's not only pretty far, but also on the other side of a hill. This village has just as much obviously fake loot. Even summoning oh Blast Furnace, which is a decision from the speedrunner that I just cannot fathom. His next destination is a nearby ruined portal, which... <sighs> After Come getting on, some blaze rods, the runner decides to trade with some piglins. But it seems okay. like he has an awful lot of gold, considering he, yeah, he barely mined any at all. So I assume he cut the video at some point to cheat in some extra. He proceeds to basically walk straight to the stronghold once back in the overworld, which makes for a nice, clean, oddly convenient entrance to the end. He finishes off the oh dragon, God, but bro. dies right as he does it. So I'm not really that sure. That's count, right? Regardless, I'll score this fake speedrun with a B for or better yourself, please. This speedrunner starts by conveniently spawning next to a village and heads right to it. But when he opens a chest in one of the houses, he finds diamonds, confirming bro, that- okay, hey, listen, if you wanna fake something, bro, please don't be too, too obvious, bro. The chance of you finding diamonds as soon as you spawn into a world, bro, in a chest, bro, in a village, bro, it's, 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 the, the odds are crazy, okay? Don't be too obvious. But it's something I would do. This chest was tampered with before the run. This continues throughout the whole village as he finds a ton of diamonds, iron, and obsidian, all in normal houses. Once he's done looting, he heads stupid. into a seemingly random direction before behaving pretty weirdly for a second and then heading back. You'll notice that when the runner stops to craft, he has a flint in his inventory. But if you look back at every chest he looted, he, he never he obtained did. a flint, implying yeah. that when he stopped just a second ago, he cut the recording and went into creative to give it to himself. Smooth. Smart. After crafting Boy, some tools was and armor, he edit. builds a nether portal with the obsidian he got from the village. But take a look at what happens when he enters the nether. Right next to the portal he exits from is a hole in the ground that perfectly resembles the size and shape of a Boy, whoever, who, bro, listen, first of all, who, whoever's video is this, like, that I'm reacting to right now, hey, you might as well get a, you, hey. I would never notice this if I was if I was a viewer, right? I promise you, I wouldn't even notice this, bro. I'll just just watch. Hey, you got a good eye, bro. I'm gonna be honest. Showing that he has entered the nether prior to the run. My theory if is I that when he was illegally setting everything up for his run, this guy went into the nether to locate a nether fortress in order to eliminate the time it would normally take to find one during the run. This explains why he went to a very specific location to build his portal in the overworld. Because if he had built it somewhere else, he would have to manually locate a fortress. He memorized the location of the fortress in proportion to the very specific location of his yeah. Portal. Something this that is shown by the fact bro, that he digs like through it. a seemingly random wall and just stumbles upon somehow, it. Yeah. Very suspicious. He goes ahead and grabs his blaze rods and ender pearls, but notice that he leaves the nether with only five eyes of ender. Something that is very weird considering most speedrunners right? generally wouldn't leave the nether until they had at least 12. Yeah, you need with more, any yeah. less, you most likely wouldn't have enough to both locate the stronghold and light the portal. But he doesn't need any more than five because once he returns to They're the overworld, in there, he runs right? in a very specific direction for a while before using a single eye and even then he throws the eye right, from no, very close to where the stronghold ends up being leading me to believe that he knew where it was yeah, beforehand he, and, and yeah. just didn't remember to throw an eye to make it look real until he was basically already there the runner enters the stronghold and locates the portal which is conveniently almost completely lit another example of how he obviously really never needed that many eyes of ender at all he enters the end and continues to defeat the dragon something that all things considered seems pretty legit to me but all in all, this guy's run really wasn't very convincing. I'll give this fake speedrun a C for kinda sucks. If you enjoyed the video, consider subscribing and following my Twitter. Linus Studios. Okay, well, is, is that this guy's name? Linus Studios? If that is your YouTube name, bro, shout out to you for this video. You have a really good eye. And, and you, you know what, bro? You're, you're really good at using... How should I say this? 
I don't want to sound rude or anything. You, you're really good at using using your context clues. Did I say that right? What I'm trying to say is like you're very smart. You're very smart because a, 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 as a viewer, I wouldn't really go in too much of a, like too much like detail. You know, if I was watching like a speed run, I'd be like, oh, okay, cool. I'm watching speed run, blah, blah blah. Some people would though. Some people would like you know try to see like if it's legit or not. And you know what? I respect that you like literally took the time to look. Okay, oh, he made an edit there. Oh, there was already a portal there. He must have edited, went back. Props to you for that, bro. Because for me, bro, I would have just sat here and not noticed nothing, bro. I would have just said, oh, well, yeah, he beat the world record, whatever, blah, blah, blah. Like, I read through, like, a few uh, speedruns on my channel before, and I don't know if all of those speedruns that I reacted to are real, but I, I know some of them are real, though. I know some of them are real. Um, but I think I did call out one that was blatantly, like, fake. And, um, and, yeah, that was the only, like, blatantly one that was fake because he knew where everything was. He also had like this weird line thing on, on his game, whatever. I don't know, but you, you could tell it was fake. But uh, other than that, bro, shout out to you for this video, bro. Really, 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 really entertainment. You gotta go check him out. I'll link the uh, the link to this chat, the link to the uh, to the video in the description down below. You guys wanna go check the video? I'll go like the video, go subscribe to this channel. Other than that, if you guys didn't enjoy my reaction, make sure you guys try to channel and like the video. I'm talking really fast for no reason right now, and I'll see you guys later for the next one. I'm out and peace. Stay hydrated and drink some water, please. Yeah, other than that, yeah, peace. Sorry.